Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many Angular developers encounter. Our viewer is working with Angular 2 high charts and wants to know how to call a component method when clicking on a high chart series. Let's dive into this challenge and explore how we can make it happen. Welcome back to another tech video. Today we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay a little bit crazy like me and find that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To call a method in your Angular component when a high chart series is clicked, we need to modify the click event in the chart options. In the click event, we will use the Angular component's context. To do this, we can use an arrow function to maintain the correct this context. Now, let's implement the method we want to call. In this case, we will create a method called method to call that logs a message to the console. Finally, Ensure that your chart options are correctly set up in the constructor of your component. This will allow the chart to render with the updated click functionality. Now, when you click on a series in the high charts chart, it will call the method to call method in your Angular component. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To call an Angular component method when clicking on a high chart series, you can use the Angular 2 high chart package. It allows access to series events. In your component, define the method that will be called. This method can log a message and access the clicked series data. You can find an updated example on Plunker for further reference. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To call an Angular component method when clicking on a high chart series, you can set up a pie chart using the high charts library. In the chart configuration, you specify the click event within the plot options. In your custom method, you can access the clicked points data. For example, you can log the name of the clicked point to the console. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your questions and hopefully found that solution that you're looking for. If we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.